welcome all family members and all the new ones I have. Thank you so much, everybody, for helping me get um, past 1,000 family members. Today, we are going to make something different. I have it in my head what to do, um, and we'll just see what happens. Come join me. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take some of my leftover turkey, and I cook a turkey differently than most people do on Thanksgiving. I have always cooked my turkey in a Reynolds turkey bag. It uh, just keeps it moist and um, I inject it with broth first before I put it in the bag. And then I put um, butter under the skin and then I um, well this this is a piece from my baby girl here skin and and then I salt and pepper it but it always turns out really moist and tender and I of course I cook it a little longer than it should be for but um, but yeah, it's, uh, I've never had complaints on my turkey. Mostly, um, mostly good, good, um, good things, good, um, compliments on my turkey and how moist it is. Here you go, baby girl. Have some, some skin. Okay, we're going to keep, I'm going to see what happens here with this. I'm just adding this in here because my phone shut off on me. So when I was making the little pie crust out of the stuffing of the dressing, whatever you call it, I mixed a small amount of gravy in with the dressing just to moisten it. And then I, um, I put that, I, I formed that around the bottom up to make a crust and the edges of the pie pan. And then I baked that. Okay, now I can't give you a specific time because my oven is pretty slow, but um, just until they get a little bit crispy on the edges, and like I had mine in like 25 minutes but I know that wouldn't take long if you have a good oven my new oven is is on the way I believe that I'm just gonna speak that out and prophesy that right now my new oven is on the way so yeah we're gonna let those cool down and then we'll go out to the next okay these have cooled down so now what we're going to do is we're going to put some turkey in there. Let's see. Put you down here so you can see what I'm doing. I'm just filling these with turkey. So good. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to take these. This one has a little more turkey than that one, so I'm gonna add it to there. Okay, now we're going to top it with some gravy. And that should soak down into that turkey. I don't know. Never done this before. Just thought of it, so. Mm. 
we will we'll see, won't we? Okay, now. And I made a big mess here. I have to clean it up. Okay. Now we're going to take a little bit more dressing and we're just going to sprinkle it on top. Like this. It's like an art project, right? And if you want to make a bigger, you know, you, you don't have to use many things. You can put this all in one big pie, one pie pan. Okay, now we're going to put these back in the oven until they just get warmed up. Put them back on the thing here. Okay, we're going to get these back in the oven. Okay, these came out of the oven. I just let the, you know, crisp up a little bit on this and... Now we can try it. I'm going to top mine with um, cranberry, gelled cranberries. Um, I, I prefer the, the ones with whole berries, but um, my husband doesn't like them, so I buy the gelled. So, yeah, let's try this. Thanks for joining me today for, I don't know what to call it, um, turkey and dressing pie, I guess. Turkey pie with dressing crust, with stuffing crust. Let's try it. Mmm, yummy. I like it. It's got the See, it's got the turkey in there and the dressing, and the the dressing's got the crust just got a crunch to it. I like it a lot. It's got the gravy in it. Look at that. Hmm. Hmm. And very convenient. Um. You can you'll be able to freeze these too, but not the, not with the cranberry sauce on it. But thanks for all my subscribers, all my family members. I pray for you every day, cause you're family. So if you're just stopping by and you think, oh wow, I wanna check her out, yeah, push the subscribe button and. Push the notification bell so you can get notified when I come up with something interesting here. So we'll see you next time. And remember, stay busy and serve others. Bye for now.